People do crazy things for love. I remember a friend of mine in college telling me that he missed his girlfriend so much who lived in like Chicago or something like that, that he drove through the night two or three days to surprise her. I think he was only with her for like a day because he had to turn around and come back because of finals that week. I guess I've done some crazy things for love too. I once dated a girl who lived in Tampa Palms and I lived in Odessa. I would drive about an hour almost every day just to see her. I can't believe how much money I put into gas. It was ridiculous. I never quite understood why love seemed to play itself out differently in different relationships, though. For example, I love God. I love him as much or even more than I love that girlfriend who lived in Tampa Palms. But why is it that I have such a hard time spending even 20 minutes with God every day? I mean, I believe the Bible to be true. I believe it when it says that God loves me and desires me to have a relationship with him. I believe it when the Bible says that I'll be blessed when I follow God. I would even say that I know prayer works. God has answered my prayers for my family, for my friends, and for myself. But why is it so hard for me to spend time with the God I love? I've heard about how great revolutions throughout the centuries have started through prayer. Prayers of men and women who love God so much that they really believe that the best thing they could do each day was to talk to the God who moves the world. I want that. I want to be part of a revolution. I want to join with people who are not content with the status quo and love God so much that they come to him as their dad and beg him to change things. And that's how revolutions begin. I want to be part of a revolution. And it has to begin with love. And I'm in love. <laughs>